Hi everyone. This is Steve. I have the family in uh, Florida this week. Just wanted to show you what I'm looking at. I was trying to get to that uh, pier, but it always looks further than you anticipate. There's, you can see the buildings down there. That's our hotel. And I finally decided to turn back. But I had a thought as I was, uh, as I was um, walking down the um, <clears throat> beach here that, uh, how do you turn this thing around? I just got this iPad. I can't figure out how to turn it around. Not that you need to see me, but, you know, it'd be nice to know how to do it. Anyway, I won't turn it around until, unless I can figure it out. But I was walking down the beach, and um, you can kind of see where those people are. There's a whole big, I think they're seagulls. I don't know what they are. There's one flying. I don't know what those things are called. But I was walking, and about 50 yards up, all of a sudden, there's a whole big flock of them sitting on the beach, standing on the beach. And I, as I as I passed them, I got to thinking that that's how we approach sin sometimes. Um, when we aren't born again, even professing Christians that aren't really regenerated by the Holy Spirit, I approached those seagulls like um, they were not a threat to me. I just I didn't deliberately walk through them, but I walked around them and I approached them like it was no big deal. And I got to thinking that if that was a pack of wolves up there 50 yards ahead of me instead of a flock of seagulls, I would have probably approached it a little bit different, I would think. I probably would have stopped dead in my tracks when I noticed there was a pack of wolves. I probably would have slowly turned around hoping they didn't notice me and I'd have got as far and fast away, away from them as I could. Um, that's how we should be approaching sin. We should be approaching sin like it's a pack of wolves that we're, we're coming upon and not a flock of seagulls. Our sin is that dangerous. It can take us further away from God and leave us condemned if we deliberately continue in it and approach it like it's a non-threatening flock of seagulls rather than a vicious pack of wolves. God bless you all. We'll see ya.